哎，你好，米切夫汤。Curry red snapper. We're gonna pan fry the fish first. Some salt in. Kosher salt. Some black pepper. And then we're gonna put this beautiful red snapper in. We are going to brown the fish on both sides. It take about a few minutes on each side. More salt here, and with my pepper right here. I use medium heat. Fry about seven minutes. Now we're gonna give them a quick flip. Oh yeah, like this. The fish looking good. We're gonna push the fish to a side and maybe add a little bit more vegetable cooking oil. We're gonna cook some spices out. So first, I got some hot chili, funnel, and cloves. In ginger and garlic, of course, will give that really nice and flavor. Hot chili paste. Oh yeah. And then I add some curry powder, coriander, paprika. Turmeric. Oh, it smells amazing now. And some red curry paste. Red curry paste. Beautiful. Huh? Simple, easy to cook at home. Then we're gonna boil some of the oil like this. We want to cook the spices. Look at that. Look at that beautiful color. And I got some cilantro stem. Just use it to cook. Get them more flavor. Here we go. I think we need a little bit more oil. Like this. Yeah, much better. Let the ingredient cook for a few minutes. Oh yes. Gonna add some sugar. The sugar will caramelize all the ingredient. Plus, when you cook curry, you do need a little sugar to balance all the flavor. Now the ingredient cook really good. So I'm gonna put some on the top here. Oh boy, smell amazing. We just want the flavor to get into the fish, you know? Oh, smells so amazing here. I wish you can smell it from here. <laughs> Oh, fish cooks beautifully like this. Let's just cook like this for a few minutes. Now it looks really good. I think it's time for us to add coconut milk in. And now we're just going to uh, mix up the sauce. Oh, it's beautiful. In Southeast Asia, if you have Penang leaf, you can add some Penang leaf. Cooking curry is versatile. You can add different kinds of spices. Depend how you like it, right? One more here. Now I'm going to cover up and let the fish and the sauce simmer for maybe 10 to 15 minutes. Now I'm gonna give the sauce a taste. Oh, look at that, beautiful. 
Oh, man. That good. I got some vegetable. I'm just going to add it in. Water chestnuts, mushroom, baby corn, pea pot, and uh, bell pepper. You can pour some sauce off the top of the fish if you like, but I kind of like it like this. It looks kind of pretty. And believe me, the sauce already penetrates into the meat. All right, we're gonna cover it back up and let them cook for maybe uh, five more minutes. Now it's done. It's ready to serve. The flavor is amazing. And best to serve with the rice or you can uh, dip with uh, nice bread. So healthy and so easy to make. Just gonna top with some cilantro. Fresh cilantro always gives them a really nice flavor. They tend to see give you better flavor with the bone. Try this recipe. Hope you like it. Please subscribe and comment. I'm Chef Tom. Thank you for watching. I see you next time. Bye.